So my name is Eric Beal. I'm a principal engineer with PowerCast, and we're here at CES 2019 showing off our wireless power technology. So how does your power technology work? Right, so the way it works is here we have our power spot transmitter. It's sending out RF energy into the air, similar to the way a Wi-Fi router works or even a cell phone when you make a cell phone call. And on these light sticks here and in our new uh, wireless charging grip here, we have our receiver chips. And our receiver chips along with an antenna pull that RF energy out of the air, convert it to DC. Here we're just lighting an LED to show you how it works, but in the grip we're actually using it to charge the batteries. So the amount of power I get is based on how close I am to the transmitter. You can see when I get really close, the LED gets really bright. But as I move far away, I get less power. But the point is, anywhere where I'm lighting up, I'm able to transmit power wirelessly. And so our first ever consumer product are these wireless charging grips for the Nintendo Joy-Con controllers. And it's pretty cool. The way it works is inside the grip here we have a battery. And this battery dumps its charge into the Joy-Con controller's battery. And then when you set this device down within one to two feet of our transmitter, it wirelessly recharges the grip's battery. And in that way, if you're an average gamer, someone who plays maybe one to two hours a day, if you set this device down when you're not gaming, you theoretically would never need to charge your Joy-Con controller again. Are there other implications for this technology, like you know, having giant towers 20 years from now that charge everything, so you never have to, have to worry about power again? I think that would satisfy Tesla's dream when he came up with this tech, the, you know, long time ago. But uh, there's a ton of applications. We've been doing this for about 15 years now. Most of that's been in the industrial space, powering sensors and devices for building automation. But in the consumer space, there's a ton of potential. We're all carrying so many gadgets now, um, headphones, uh, video game controllers like we're showing here, smartwatches, fitness bands, all this stuff. And we're getting sick of having to charge these things all the time. So we're trying to create an ecosystem here where you don't have to think about it. You set your devices down at night when you're not using them, they recharge, you pick them up in the morning, you're ready to go. So that's the idea. How much is it and when does it come out? So the power spot is available now. We had it at CES last year. We said we would uh, debut it in quarter three. We would be shipping it in quarter three of this year, of last year, I'm sorry. And we did at $99. You can get that uh, through DigiKey uh, or Mauser Electronics. The Switch, we're doing the same thing this year. So quarter three of this year, we plan on shipping it. And there's a couple different versions. We're going to sell them as bundles. So you get the, the charger and the grip at the sun. We have a single, a double, left and right, different options for, for each one. And uh, we'll have that available in the third quarter of this year, ready for Christmas time. So there are, there are two questions we get all the time. The first, the number one question is, can you charge my cell phone? And the answer is yes, but given FCC regulations, we're limited to one watt of output power from our transmitter. So we can charge a phone, but it's gonna take a really long time and it's not gonna be a great user experience, so we're not actively pursuing it. The second question we always get is, is it safe? And I always say the same thing. If you're comfortable using a cell phone, this guy's orders of magnitude lower in exposure in the way that it's meant to be used. So you're not holding it next to your head, you don't have it in your pocket. It's meant to be set on your bedside table with, and not interacting with close notes. So I always say if you're comfortable using a cell phone, you should be comfortable using this.